Another big story we're following. This could be a huge step forward for Oregonians who want to legalize marijuana. A powerful state lawmaker plans to introduce legislation legalizing the drug in Oregon if Californians pass a similar measure in November. K2 Salem Bureau Chief Melika Johnson joins us. So Melika, polls show Californians voting in favor of legalization. Well, that's right. According to a recent poll released by the Associated Press this past weekend, 49% of California voters say they will vote to legalize marijuana with 42% against it. Now, what that means if that measure passes in California is Oregonians could be voting on a very similar measure here in the near future. Under a proposal to legalize the drug in Oregon, state lawmakers would vote on whether to refer the question to voters. Voters would then decide if they want the drug taxed and sold in Oregon regulated by a new cannabis control commission. Marijuana would then be sold in liquor stores to people over 21. The Democratic co-chair of the powerful Ways and Means Committee says marijuana prohibition just isn't working. We say, my gosh, you know, we're having a hard time funding education for our kids. We're having a very hard time funding care programs for our seniors and disabled, yet we're still spending resources on a prohibition on marijuana where we act could actually be bringing in revenue. Where are we going to stop? Are we going to legalize cocaine and heroin next? Are we going to tax cocaine and heroin next because some politician wants to do that? This retired narcotics officer says if Oregon legalizes marijuana, it will pit the state against the drug cartels for control of the marijuana market and will actually make the streets more dangerous. Now, the Oregon lawmaker behind this proposal says he only plans to introduce this legislation next session if that law passes in California or if it is narrowly defeated. Live at the state capitol, Melika Johnson, K2 News. A lot of people will be watching what happens in California. Melika, thank you.